In this Adobe After Effects tutorial, we'll be learning to make this curtains background in a very simple way. So, let me first click on this so that we create a new composition. 1920 by 1080 resolution is fine. I'll name this curtain and I'll hit OK. So, the next thing is to add a solid. To do that, I'll click on Layer and from New, I'll click Solid. Any color is fine, so I'll hit OK. As this is a beginner's tutorial, we'll be making use of the available animation presets. So, from the FX panel, I'll type in Curtain. So, you have this Curtain effect in the backgrounds of the animation presets, and I'll drag this onto the solid. If I start playing the video, you can see that we have this curtains background. So if I hit U on the keyboard, you can see that we have this keyframe. If you move this keyframe towards the left or right, the duration of the animation would change. So you can change this accordingly. In the tritone, you can see that we have different colors. So you can set different colors of your curtain and generate some nice backgrounds depending on your requirement. However, you can also tweak multiple properties that you have here. In the fractal type, from swirly, I can change this to cloudy so that it will look something like this. And you can also click on dynamic twist or any other property. You can increase or decrease the brightness. You can also change the complexity so that you know, there are more number of folds to the curtain. Adobe After Effects is all about creativity. You can tweak multiple options here depending on your requirement and generate cool backgrounds for your project. I hope you found this video helpful. If that's the case, give us a thumbs up. Consider subscribing to the channel. And see you guys next time with another tutorial.